What's up, squad team? What's up, squad? Um, hi, hi, hi. So, I, um, look at this, look at this chaos I have in my house. Watch it ensue. Come here. <coughs> hey, no negatron. Uh, oh, look how big this beast. Oh, mamas. So my girlfriend's cat, my girlfriend moved in with me and she brought a cat. And this monster attacks the kitties. She attacks Maximus. But look how cute. Mamas. She's so smart. She can, oh, okay, okay, okay. Let me get the cat. Let me show you the cat. Here's Mr. Man. Mr. Man. Oh. All right. So, um, this is about, um, the video. Oh, I got a new tattoo. Also. Check it out. Uh, right here. Isn't it dope? It's it's peeling right now, so it doesn't look that good, but Gia, I love it. It's my favorite one. Uh, okay. So I've been like hella busy, man. College is cray Z. So I might I was thinking about joining again. About going back in. Maybe like in a couple years, or like in a year or two, um, cause like school is just not really cutting it. I don't know. No, it's fine. It's just like I was so used to, um, cause after high school I just joined the navy, right away. So, um, for the past like five years, you know, I was used to just working and then going home or to my barracks after work and just kind of memory dump and everything and just relaxing, you know, but now with college and school, you have, you know, not being in the military, you have school that you have to go to, you have to go to class, right, all day, some days, you have to go home and do homework all the time, and that's on top of working, that's on top of whatever else you got going on, you know, going to the gym, girlfriend, dog, um, YouTube, you know, everything. So, I don't know. I don't think my school is definitely a lot harder for me. Like, my study habits are really bad. Really bad study habits. I do everything the night before, mostly, or the morning of. Pretty good. Pretty good, I'd say. Come here, Gray. Come here. Come here. Um. Ugh. Got her. But she's a big girl, huh? She's a happy puppy, though. Have kisses. Kisses. Have kisses. Have kisses. Okay. Hey, hey easy there, Tyrone. Easy there, Tyrone. Ah, oh, God. She's like 20 pounds. So, yeah, like I was saying, it's like going to school and having to do school and then come back home and do school. Like, I was like, fuck, in the Navy, like in the military, I was just chilling. You know, when I wasn't on deployment, it's nice. It's easy. Like, you do your, you know, eight, nine-hour days, whatever, ten-hour days, and then you go home, you go to the barracks, and you're done. You get to relax. And then you get weekends off. You don't have to worry about, you don't have to worry about anything. You know, like, what should I have to worry about? Like, um, appointments and stuff and just life. It sounds like I'm complaining, but I'm just comparing parallels. So yeah, I was thinking of maybe going back in because I have a, when I got out, I got out with the honorable discharge and a re-enlistment code of RE1, which I'm pretty sure is the best, which is the best like re-enlistment code you can get, which basically means, I don't know what it means, but I think it means I have a good chance of being able to go back in, like rejoining within a certain amount of time. And I get to keep my, I would be able to keep E5, like my rank. Um, I would maybe look into joining another branch too. Like maybe I'll look into the army. Not as like a, um, 
infantryman, but more like a more technical rate. Or I might finish my fucking degree and go back in as an officer in the Navy if I could. I'd have to, I'd have to like apply for it, I think. But since I'm prior enlisted, I, I have to go talk to like a, a recruiter, a special recruiter, you know, for my circumstances um, to see what my options would be. But yeah, thinking about joining again. So I just want to let y'all know. Thinking about it. All right. Peace.